Hello viewers, this is Dikshit Kumar. Now let us solve this problem using ANSYS. Given is a cantilever beam. So you have to draw the shear force and bending moment diagram. So you can see that the cross section area, the Young's modulus, the Poisson's ratio is given. A load of 10 kN is acting. Now let us check for the theoretical solution here. So you can note down the theoretical solution. So this is the shear force and bending moment diagram which you have to get so let us begin go to preferences select structural click on ok go to preprocessor element type add click on add here select beam select 2d node 188 click on ok close now go to material properties select material models select structural linear elastic isotropic now enter the Young's modulus here 210 into 10 to the power of 3 Newton per mm square and Poisson's ratio is 0.27 click on OK close now go to sections there select beam common sections the breadth you have to make it as 200 and height as 300 so it is a rectangular cross section area click on ok now go to modeling click on create key points in active CS so click on apply the first key point will be created and the set the X distance as 5000 mm click on ok the second key point will be created there so now click on lines again click on lines select straight line now pick 1 and 2 click on ok Now go to meshing, their size controls, manual size, global, again size, now the size element edge length make it as 10, number of element division make it as 100, click on OK. Now select mesh. lines a box will appear so here you have to pick all click on pick all now go to plot select lines so you can see the meshing there now go to solution define load apply structural displacement on key points select the key point number one apply DOF to be constrained all DOF click on OK now select force on key point select key point number two click on apply direction of force FY the value of force it is negative 10 kilo Newton 10 into 10 to the power of 3 Newton click on OK so you can see the force there now click on solve current LS click on OK solution is done close close now go to general post processor their element table define table click on add so result data item by sequence num SM ISC make it as 3 click on apply again select by sequence num now make it as 6 click on apply 
now select sequence num now make it as 16 click on apply again by sequence num now make it as 19 now click on ok you can see 3 6 16 19 close now go to plot results their counter plot line element results so node i select 6 at node j sm is 19 so click on ok now the shear force diagram will appear on the screen you can note down the minimum and maximum value select line element result select sm is 3 and 16 click on ok the bending moment diagram will be displayed with the maximum and minimum value so that's it thank you for watching mm -hmm.